If you want to delete the table of contents, you can click on the down arrow that appears in your existing table of contents and then select remove. Or you could go back to the window table of contents and then remove from that window. And your table of contents is now gone. I'm going to get back my table of contents automatically. I'm selecting this option and I've got three different levels. When I look at this table of contents, I do not see those icons that I had previously. In order to see the icons, you click inside of the table of contents and these icons now appear. I notice that after I've added the table of contents, my page numbering appears to be incorrect. As I scroll down, I have the discussion and the conclusion on page two. Uh, however, that's not correctly reflected on the table of contents. So what I would need to do is to update my table of contents and I can click on this particular option. Clicking on that, it wants to know whether I want to update page numbers only or to update the entire table. In this instance, I'm only interested in updating the page numbers and I click on OK. Having done that, if I click outside of it, I can now see that my discussion and the conclusion is on page two. So I can keep my table of contents in my document and I can make changes. And let's say, for example, I change this heading uh, to literature and it's no longer literature review and page numbering, I could have add paragraphs. So my page numbering would have all been uh, offset and they would need to be updated. In order to do that, I can click onto the table of contents and then update the table again. And when I update the table, I will say update the entire table. And this time round, it would update the page numbers as well as any changes in the headings. Sometimes you can see some part of this highlighted. To get rid of that, you can just click outside of that table of contents um, window and that should then be removed. So if I click out of it, I'm expecting it to be remo removed, but it's not. So maybe let me try clicking above here and I see that has now been removed. But if I look at this particular heading, it has now been updated and it says literature and it's no longer literature review. So you can leave the table of contents in your document you can, at the end, once you completed, update. You can then update this table of contents. Another possible way would be to right click and then to say update field. By clicking on update field, I then am prompted whether to update the page numbers only or to update the entire table. If you enjoyed watching this video, Get ready to take it to the next level. Don't hold back. Smash that like button. Drop a comment in the comment section and make sure to subscribe so you never miss out on the contents that's yet to come. Catch you in the next video. Bye for now.